but <coughs> I guess that's it. This is it. This is the end of my Hitchens tribute video. Uh, Johnny Walker, Black Label. Um, you know, I'm not a huge fan of uh, labels or companies. Um, but I do enjoy chemistry. So, thank you for the chemistry. And, um, you know, my uh, brand of tobacco, American Spirit. Uh, thank you for that. Um, I know. Maybe the American Spirit will kill me someday. Um, I'm not really worried about that. I've enjoyed this life um, so far. You know, it's been good. Even if I were to spend 20 years in, in a dungeon being tortured, um, it would be worth it just to look back and remember um, how free I've been and, uh, and to wonder, you know, how free we can be. I mean, let's just, just keep pushing that. You know the boundaries of what freedom is because there was a time when we were genuine you know really free we were really free just just a long time ago um and and i'm not sure if this trend will continue or not but we are losing our freedom the more laws are passed the more things are owned, um, the less free we are. You know, the more we have to do things that we may not want to do in order to get the things that we want. So, no. Um, for any of you listening to this who live in America and think America is the freest country, you're fucking stupid. Okay? Straight up. You're not free. Nobody is free. Okay, food is not free. Um, even if you're a farmer, you know, you still have to pay a certain amount. I mean, I um, ideally farming should be absolutely free. Um, but no, man, this fucking land tax. There's um, there's just so much shit, and it's impossible. It is flat out impossible. So. So the idea that we are free is bullshit. We may be freer than <coughs> some other places, but to be honest with you, I think America, this country, is the least free. Um, I don't know. So far, Saudi Arabia's really bugged me. Um, they're the one country that I've looked into that has like Sharia law and um, you know like mandatory Islam nearly mandatory um, everything else is just completely put down and you are you know I don't know if it's true or not but you're, you're killed um, so I've read for, for practicing Christianity in Saudi Arabia uh, you're killed for being an atheist in Saudi Arabia. You know, they just don't let you in. Unless I'm sure if you had the money and you just kept your mouth shut and just focused on business. Like, you know, checking out the plants and everything and making sure that, you know, your investment was doing okay. And if you were given the company or the country, the country owns all the oil. Um, for those of you that didn't know that. Um, both Iran and Saudi Arabia, um, there are no independent companies. Um, they're both, they both have, uh, their oil is owned by the government. And uh, their oil companies are owned by the government. So you have to work with them in order to get it. And that's where we get, you know, a huge amount. You know, I don't know the exact quantity. But, uh, you know, I would be willing to guess that, you know, a good, I don't know, 75% or so 
of the world's oil comes from the Persian Gulf, the area essentially centered around Kuwait. It goes up into Iraq, over into Iran, and down into Saudi Arabia. That whole area. You know, it's just a part of how life was on Earth um, hundreds of billions, of, or excuse me, hundreds of millions of years ago, um, during about the um, Cambrian and the pre Cambrian era and life that was living in uh, swamps and marshes and things in that area and uh, just the layers that built up over time and compressed it just hundreds hundreds of millions of years ago and a lot of pressure and just chemistry and it's broken down and that's what's left the strongest bonds the hydrocarbon bonds you know it's just just uh, carbon oxygen and hydrogen that's it. That's all it is. Carbon, oxygen, and hydrogen. And uh, so much. So much of this shit. This plastic of this bag. This lighter. You know, the plastic. You know, we use it for everything. You look at the packaging material. It's, uh... It's on everything. The frame for this monitor the plastic case around that camera you know the coating on the wire plastic that's where the real money's at I don't know if any of you remember um, the graduate I think the movie was called with um, Dustin Hoffman yeah remember when that guy pulled him pulled him out like because he was talking about his daughter think and uh he pulled him outside and he was like i just want to talk to you i just want to say one word just one word are you listening to me are you listening plastics that's it plastics yeah and, he, and dustin was like okay <laughs> you know okay yeah i got it okay <laughs> i guess and then the movie just keeps going on. But, like, that was like a little hint, you know. Sometimes people do know what they're talking about, but you don't really hear about it too much. I mean, you don't you don't see it in movies where people are alluding, you know, to the truth and to um, what's important. I mean, just what's going on. You know, again, like the network, you know. And I guess I don't really watch much modern TV be or television or movies or anything because there's just so much shit so much shit to wade through it's all fucking scripted and bullshit for the most part a lot of it's just a joke I mean what's really going on right now today in the world where the money's at um, you know the people in China and the people in uh, let's see, west, that's east. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. On the on the other side of the earth, you know, what's going on over there? Because I mean, if you think about it, if you're in North America or South America, you're like what one, two billion people tops we are on this side of the planet. The rest of everyone, five billion people or more are on the other side essentially the other side of the planet you know in uh, in Asia in uh, in Europe and Africa Africa Africa's down there um you know in Australia Africa's over there Australia's over there um this is a friggin matters but yeah some of you may um, want to know? But yeah, man, it's that's what's going on. That's what we're doing. And uh, I can't say I don't like, you know, what we're doing for the most part. I guess. It's it's the it's it's the monetary system. 
I don't really want to get into all that, but it's the money that is uh, keeping people from doing what's really good for other people, for the people who need things, really. Um, and not in not in America so much as in the rest of the world. It's uh, well, the poor in America. You know, we have like food, food uh, kitchens and shelters and stuff. And there's just so many buildings and so many heat sources and so many, so many places to go. And I mean, you can you can live here. You can be homeless and live in America. There's just so much waste, you know, the, the idea of dumpster diving and stuff. Um, there's just so much flowing around that even the poorest people get something. And uh, yeah, it's kind of terrible that they have to live that way if you're, uh, if you're middle class or, uh, you know, I don't know, I'm a big fan of the class structure thing, but, you know, if you're uh, financially lower class or financially middle class or financially upper class, couldn't give a fuck. But um, at any point, I imagine especially the upper class people who just kind of write it off. And so, you know, well, I throw away so much. Uh, if they really want it, they can go and get it, you know. Or, uh, yeah, we put a lot of stuff in our dumps here, you know, so we're taking care of the poor. You know, we got, like, restaurants and, and businesses and stuff, and we mark things down at Walmart. Yeah. So, anyway. I really wish I could upload videos longer than 15 minutes. Uh, but it's a shame I got to break this up because I know that like people that watch the first one are probably gonna be like, "This is all he's doing," and uh, maybe I'm not gonna watch, so they'll never see this if this is at the end. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Maybe if I get back into doing this, I'll I'll make more. Maybe I'll be more specific about things. Um, if you've managed to watch all of these videos, then uh, thank you. And uh, see you next time. Next video. See you tomorrow. Not tomorrow. That's not my thing. Maybe. Who knows? Maybe I'll make another video today. Tonight. I don't know. It's uh, 4.49 right now. So, that's it. The end.